Hi everyone, so I wanted to show you what I've been working on. Um, I've actually been doing my daughter's birthday party, so I haven't been posting as much. Uh, but it's Saturday, and I had like all the party stuff done, so I figured, hey, why not just start creating again? So I went to Michael's and I purchased this letter. It's just an N from Art Minds. I spray painted it, or not, I spritzed it with Lindy Stamp Gang um, Alpine Rose. Can, I don't know if you guys can see some of the back thing that came to the back. But then I used a Prima paper. It's from the Princess Collection. Um, to cover the front. These are all Wild Orchid Craft Roses. I, I'm covering the light. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, all the Wild Orchid Craft Roses. Um, this is Want to Scrap Pearl Bling. This is Prima... This is a Prima flower that I'll show you in another video because I went to a store and I bought a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, again, uh, another Prima piece back here. Wild Orchid Crafts. These are the Recollections Butterflies. Here. I cut up uh, some of my vintage lace because some of the lace comes like in shapes, like, you know, with flowers and stuff. So I cut some out. Same thing with this one. And this was my end result. So end, you know, Obviously, Norma. So this is my letter. I'm going to put that here. I'll figure out where I'm going to hang it later. And then I went crazy with the new Graphic 45 Botanical Tea Paper Pack. I am in love with it. Literally. I'm, I'm in love with it. I'm to the point that I bought another pack. And I have it sealed because I'm a hoarder and I don't want to, like, use it up. So I bought one to use and one to keep. Go figure. So since I love it a lot, I didn't want to ruin, or not ruin, but like embellish it too much. I just wanted to keep the paper. So what I did was I kept the, the you know, they give you two sheets. I did one sheet and then I fussy cut a lot of the pieces to make them um, dimensional or 3D, however you want to say it. And I think it came out great. I love this. So this is my altered cigar box. Again, this is all from the same collection. I vented the bottom. And on the, on the inside, I didn't paint it. I kept it the natural wood. I used more paper from Botanical Tea. And guys, if you haven't gone out to get that paper, it is beautiful. It's awesome. And I can tell you it's awesome because I did another project with it. I did this. Um, it's a... Uh, also from Want to Scrap, it's a, like a, for an album. Obviously, there's a little hook. It's a little teapot. Came five, but I'll do the other one slowly. So on this, again, I used the Botanical Tea Paper Pack, um, Wild Orchid Roses, some Recollections uh, Bling, and then I used a mini a mini tilde and a whimsy stamp. I colored them up with Copics and. You know, I went crazy with my flowers again, but I also put in some, I fussy cut some flowers and, and leaves from the scraps that I was having to add them to this. And then, you know, I just put a, a lace bow because I felt like it was missing something. So, so yeah, so those are the three projects that I've worked on so far in between the, my daughter's party. Hopefully this gives you guys some uh, inspiration to do something, you know, cool and go get this paper because it's awesome. Thanks for watching, guys.